Well, let's talk about the uh, defense and uh, the identity you guys are trying to forge here post Borland, post a lot of other talented guys. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, it's been a great, great spring for our defense. Obviously, uh, we have a lot of young guys on the team. Guys stepping up into new roles, new positions, and I believe that we, uh, over time, this spring have really grown as a defense, and I think we will continue to build our identity this offseason with our workouts and so forth, and uh, I'm excited to see what the uh, future holds for Wisconsin Badgers defense. What were question marks coming into spring in your mind, and, and what, what answers were provided by the defense? Well, some of the uh, questions would definitely be some of the key players leaving. Uh, Chris Bourne, uh, Bo Allen, uh, Pam Aldoon, Brian Kelly, a lot, a lot of our linebacking core. A lot of key pieces missing, so um, I think this a whole uh, spring ball was about learning the defense, new guys stepping up in their roles and becoming a great defense as a whole, and, and, and finding our identity as a new defense. As you talk about that, uh, you know, we, we know what kind of physical uh, qualities those guys brought to the field, but with guys like Bo and, and Chris, there's a lot of personality yeah. there too. Oh yeah. How, how, how did guys step up and fill those roles? Are there guys that are vocally and, and, uh, and I guess comically be, you know, providing the same kind of leadership? Absolutely. You know, Chris Bullen and Bro Allen are both uh, great vocal leaders on our team, both team captains, and I think that was one of our, you know, big issues coming in this, this spring ball. Not issues, but per se, but uh, uh, people stepping up. I think we have a lot of uh, vocal guys stepping up, um, such as like Marcus Trotter, myself, you know, Landish, being those local guy, uh, lo vocal guys, guys who can we who can count on, and. Um, you know, I think over time, over spring ball has progressed. I think we've all done that, and um, I think I'm comfortable where we're at. What do you feel good about going now into the fall and in the summer and the fall about where you guys are at defensively? You know, honestly, we, we're a hungry defense. That's probably one of the most things I got to say is guys are eager to learn. Guys are in new spots. Guys are, um, you know, we have we have overall not just from first, second string, but overall, you know, fifth string, fifth, sixth string guys. Are excited to learn this program and, and, and are excited to build themselves as uh, as football players. And the, I'm, I know obviously you don't let up now during the summertime. A lot of work to do before yep. fall. How do you balance that with just kind of you know taking some time for yourself? Yeah, I mean obviously this spring going to heal the body for the next couple of weeks, but I'm um, going to get back at it. We're going to be a young team, as all of you guys know, and um, I think that the guys will. Uh, Taylor to that. I think Coach, uh, we have great weight room guys such as uh, Evan Simon, our uh, Jameel Walker will get will take care of us this uh, this winter or this excuse me this summer, and I think we'll be in a good spot. Thanks.